Good morning. <coughs> 8.02. <02. coughs> late, late start to the day. But I'm only going 20 minutes down the road. I haven't got to be there till 9. So uh, we're going to get the early. See what happens. So leaving here for the last time this week. Murky day though. Well, traffic, which is why I'm setting off early, so uh, I should be there by about half eight. No one's going to let me out, are they? Because they don't want to be um, behind a lorry. Oh, a bit misty murky today, look. Quiet night, slept well. Over eight hours of sleep, solid eight hours. It's really unusual for me. But, uh, nice. Which means I'll be a bit more alive tonight instead of wanting to go to bed at seven o'clock. I might be able to stay up a bit later. After a quarter of a mile, cross the roundabout and take the second exit, A5, towards Brown Hills. You know, when you get up at two in the morning, uh, there you go. Cross the roundabout and take the second exit. You get up at two o'clock in the morning, you can't still, still be expected to be the life and soul at eight, nine o'clock at night. You're dead to the world on the Friday, on the fire, on the, in the evening at eight, nine o'clock at night. Way past your bedtime. So, 
know, it's, it's nice just to be normal for a week. It's been very nice. Surprised about how much of a difference has actually made to me, to be honest. Or rather, how much. What surprised me is the difference I feel is that how much getting up at 2 3 o'clock in the morning takes its toll on me. Still yawning now. How can I be yawning after saying all that? I feel I do feel better. After 900 feet, go left on the roundabout and take the second exit, A460 Eastern Way. Well, you got some camper vans in there. Love it. plenty of time. Malarkey like this. Uh, tomorrow we're going to uh, Nottingham. Take my daughter back to uh, Nottingham. Back to uni for a final term. Blimey, she's been doing three years after 300 feet, go uni. left on the roundabout and take the second exit, A460 Eastern Way. Three years. Okay, let's concentrate, this is roundabout. <clears throat> I'm getting myself into all sorts of bother otherwise. This lane. Bear right, then cross the roundabout and take the first exit. No, what are you talking about? Is this roundabout here? <clears throat> After 300 feet, cross the roundabout and take the first exit, A5, towards Brown Hills. What's this one? You didn't even mention the other one. Cross the roundabout and take the first exit. Look at that. Successfully negotiated those pain in the arse roundabouts. It's alright coming this way.
less than four miles away. <clears throat> Gotta be tired. Try and suss out which is the best way to uh, get back from here. Got to get in front, got to get in front. the roundabout and take the second exit, A5, towards Brown Hills. Brown Hills, that's where we're going. Headness Ford, not a Wedness Ford, Headness Ford. Heads. Headsford. I think is how you'd pronounce it. Or was it Wed Wensbury? Oh, I can't remember. One or the other. Somebody did say, you know what my memory's like? Bag of shine. With holes in. After 300 feet, cross the roundabout and take the second exit, A5, towards Brown Hills. <coughs> cool. No one is yet to tell me why they call it a frog in your phone. Because I should Google it. Where does that saying come from? Because when you go, <coughs> and you say, oh, I've got a frog, it doesn't sound nothing like a frog. Well, not any frogs that I know. The Cracking Cafe is open, apparently, to the left. There's a little note down there. So if you're ever in the area and want to go to a Cracking cracking Cross Cafe. Cross the roundabout and take the second exit, A5, towards Brown Hills. Cracking cafe full of crack. Oh, that's me. Uh, oh no, because we're still going. We're still moving. Oh, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to get beeped at. No, I'm not. I don't know. I don't care. No, we're moving. As long as my wheels are moving, I don't care. Come on, come on, Bob. Oh, I'm glad I left when I did actually. Let's move up here. It's just. It, it, do you know what the problem is? The problem is two lanes in the one. Two lanes in the one. If they'd have kept it just one lane, everybody would have flowed on, you know, rather nicely, but. You get bottlenecks. Ridiculous. It's the end of canal there. 
end of the line. Busy looking at the farmer. See, they've got stables in there, look. Pay a lot of money to have your horse kept in a stable. I know someone who pays four hundred pound a month just to ride a horse. It's not even theirs. I wouldn't want to start keeping horses. I know the gorgeous Kira, gorgeous Kira has a bit of a plan for one. She wants an Icelandic pony. That is what she used to ride. Hardy little buggers, as you would imagine if they come from Iceland. <clears throat> See, once we get past that, like, two lanes going into one, we're trundling along quite happily now. Right, this next roundabout, I've got to go one round. Round. Round and round about. So I think this is the uh, roundabout with the... After um, a quarter of a mile, cross the roundabout and take the second exit, A5, towards Tamworth. Not this one. Go straight across here. Oh, hang on. Where are they taking me? Taking me a different way. Okay. Cross the roundabout and take the second exit. This wasn't the way I thought it was going to take me. <clears throat> Maybe that's not the truck route. Going this way is apparently it's one minute slower, but yeah. let's go here then. I think I'm going the way I thought I was going yesterday. Three quarters of a mile, turn right, B5011, towards Brown Hills. Okay. Let's uh, start getting over. Feet, turn right, B5011, towards Brown Hills. That's 
good. Another big truck up here. Through here. All good fun. Left at these lights. After 600 feet, turn left, B4155, Litchfield Road, then you have reached your destination, it is on your left. Turn left, then you have reached your destination, it is on your left. Well, this is a fun junction to get around. If uh, it had pulled right up to the bumper, right up to the line. Anyway, I'm more or less here. I'll speak feet, to you a little later. Reached your destination. It is Hello. I don't know how much you can see, but where that truck is leaving, I've got to get in there. Why would you plant? Why would you uh, leave that van there? I'm going forwards now. Oh, bloody place. Super tight. Then to get onto that loading bank. Well, once I'm around the corner, it's all right. How you doing, boss? All right? <laughs> The old boy ended up loading him, he's a bit slow. <laughs> he's alright. There's actually a little bit more room than I thought. As long as I can get around this corner, get down there and then uh, back around to there. Should be alright. container ain't raising up. I think it's all up for me to get round here now. Doable. Yeah, that's all right. That was all right. There. Yeah. Nice I'll oh, straighten up. Not that I can see anything at the moment. Down 
down that other window, oh, it's right over. I need to take a couple of little shunts at this. I think I might have to open the doors. Let's uh, open the doors before I go on in. Anyway, I'll speak to you all in a bit. Well, this is some place. Let's go around here. Uh. <laughs> we seem to have a bit of a Get down there. The link. Gonna have to go and have a look. Nice. Because we don't do containers, I said I'm not unloading here, mate. Tight round here, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. There's that other loading bay I just had to load on. That was a pain in the arse as well. well. Cheers, fella. Watch mirror. There's some cases down to my left. Telling me to go left. There's geez, um, forks all over the place.
Oh, what a place. That's where I had to go, down in there. Where he's going. We all try to help each other out, you know, as drivers, and nine times out of ten, you know, we're all, uh, everyone's on the same page, but... There's no high vis warning here, I tell you. So let's come out of here and turn left, it's telling me. It's us, this man here. What's the best way out of here, mate? Where are you heading? Back down south. Turn left. I turn left, mate. It's yeah. easier, isn't it? Yeah. Left right. Round about turn down on A5 and then. then, then A5, Sounds yeah. good to me. Lovely. Cheers, my friend. Thanks a lot. Yeah. That's what we'll do. Okay. Complete. Complete. It's 1117. Traffic, what's going on here? I think we've got a bit of weight on us. After a quarter of a mile, go left on the roundabout and take the first exit, B4155, Barracks Lane. Edges. Just cut them. Telegraph pole sticking out. Quite a narrow old road down here. Good man. Left on the roundabout and take the first exit B for Barracks Lane. Uh, then turn right and back on the A5. Back on familiar territory. See, this is this After is the way I've got to go. It's like go right on the roundabout and take the third exit A5 towards Tamworth. I know that if we ever come here again. Coming down here. Go right on the roundabout and take the third exit. Well, let's get this high vis off, I don't need that. And we're good to go. Nice and gentle, I don't want me apple flying down the dashboard. It's all pallet top, there's a scooter. Jeez. Uh. Right, next stop, Southampton Docks. Speech is all later. Hello, well, pit stop. Keep left, then keep right. Traffic was really slow coming out of where well, I tipped all around the M42, all around there. It was just keep crawling. Keep right, then. Take the motor way. So as a result, I haven't got enough time to get myself down and round the docks, so I've got to take a half hour break. Um, it'll be just over half hour. I'll be on the docks at four o'clock, which is a lot later than I wanted to be. On a Friday afternoon, on a bank holiday right, weekend. Keep right. Go on you nubber, get on in there. Keep right, then Malt. turn right. I imagine going down into uh, Southampton is going to be busy as well, so... Turn right, then bear left. Bear's left. So, I'm going to use the facilities, get myself something to eat. 
and then uh, get back on the road again because that would take me half hour to do all of that. But there's nobody in here. Oh, DVSA. They're in here. Turn right. I think they're packing up now. I think they're going home. Yeah, taking all the cones in, look. They've done enough. They want an early finish, don't they? <laughs> Oh dear. Oh, a bit busy around here. Cool, all load of tents. All air fools, they don't sleep in tents. Look like tent bags. Let's go here. I can use that bin then. Right. I'll speak to you all later. Hello. Well, I've had a uh, half hour break, which is what I needed. This will get me down to the docks for four o'clock. Might need After to take a another couple of mile, minutes. Turn left. No bears, no bears to my left. Oh, it's warm. Reserve fuel again. Turn left. trucks running today, there's not many trucks in the services at all. After 600 feet, bear left, M40, then uh, turn left. Bears. Bear left, then turn left. Seven, eight minutes delay, delays. I right, say so I'm going to get down at quarter past four now. Don't know. See how that pans out. Google's not telling me that, so you know. we'll see. We'll get there when we get there. Looking for a four to five VBS, so it's still okay at the moment. Down the road, see how far we can get. Speeches all later.